Hey guys, I'm John from Switchbird. Just wanted to spend a few minutes to introduce you to the wonders and efficiencies of QR code calls to action that drive to messaging like SMS and Google Chat uh, rather than traditional web URLs. We've been experimenting with this for a few weeks here at Switchbird and it's a really powerful combination. Uh, why? Uh, I think there are really two reasons. Uh, one is on the right-hand side of my screen, you've got uh, the evolution of the consumer device and the consumer. Uh, the consumer device, both iOS and Android now have QR code scanners built right into uh, the camera app. So there's no need for some specialty app uh, from the App Store or Google Play Store. Everybody's got this functionality baked right into their phone, ready to go. And consumers themselves are a lot more familiar with the technology than they were maybe a few years ago, you know, thanks to a couple of years of touch-free uh, communication campaigns that use QR codes for everything from marketing and advertising to things like, you know, getting your menu at the restaurant. Uh, and, you know, even... You know, just this year, the Coinbase ad uh, at the Super Bowl um, with the QR code, you know, bouncing around the screen, uh, it had opened the eyes of a lot more consumers to what QR codes are, how to scan them, and so it's become really a frictionless way to uh, get the consumer to your um, destination via a simple, you know, call to action. Uh, but now pairing that with um, messaging uh, to get the consumer right into a conversation with your business rather than driving them to some you know, URL where they're gonna fill out a lead gen form. Uh, this is super powerful and this is what I'm gonna show. So on the uh, left-hand side of my screen, we've got our uh, Switchbird inbox uh, flow diagram here. Uh, this is all the you know, usual stuff, uh, but this is actually the, the Switchbird's Switchbird inbox, right? This is our own inbox where we have a bunch of these keyword triggered flows. And now you can trigger these flows like to book a demo uh, by texting uh, demo to our number. And of course, uh, that will confirm your contact information uh, and get you right into the uh, demo booking routine. Uh, but you can also now uh, use this uh, simple QR code uh, and use that to have your you know, book a demo call to action, right? So here we go. Let's uh, scan that real quick, boom. It gets us right into a messaging conversation with Switchbird, uh, and we should see uh, that, yes, all right, we get our um, opt-out language, and boom, we get the same uh, type of uh, responsiveness here now via our QR code. And, and so you can see the power actually right here, right where, um, by virtue of getting the consumer from a QR code into a messaging conversation, we get all the benefits of uh, knowing who that consumer is, having their best point of contact information, their phone number, uh, and <clears throat> uh, doing a reverse lookup uh, as we have here on their phone number to get other, you know, name and identifying information, demographic data, what, whatever we need, we don't need to ask for it in a web form. Uh, we get it by virtue of starting the conversation. Now, uh, this also applies, you know, outside of uh, text messaging per se. So, um, you know, some uh, messaging channels like Google Chat and Facebook Messenger have really um, nice user experiences on the, on the app side, you know, compared with SMS, right? Like here in, in SMS, I've got to type out, yes. Um, and let me get rid of that, hold on. Uh, and let's see, I should get back. Yeah, I got to type out the number. So let's say, okay, I'll do Monday. <laughs> anyway, it's, you know, it's SMS. I mean, it's, it, it's great, but it's uh, not quite the uh, experience that we might get with, uh, say Google Chat, right? So um, we've been, we actually started this QR stuff with, with Google Chat because it was a, a simpler way to um, just to kind of see how your, you know, your, your messaging agent is set up and how it performs, especially when you build one out um, in Switchbird, like it's, it's, uh, we want to make it like 
super easy to uh, get to the actual um, agent in the wild. And so uh, we built these uh, QR codes, which let us do that. And so if I scan that, um, that brings me right into the, oh, hold on, let me um, fix my mirroring one second. All right, let's try this again from the top so you don't think I'm a liar here. So we'll go, we'll scan the uh, QR code. Okay, so we go right to the agent in Google Maps. And as you can see uh, on the right hand side of the screen here, um, we've got a really nice uh, sort of, um, you know, click and go uh, version of this experience, uh, experience for scheduling a demo, right? So let's see how this works. Boom. There we go. We get our typing indicator, so it feels a little more interactive. And then we have our little chips here with our uh, choices, so we don't have to type in, you know, one, two, three, four, etc. Uh, so anyway, this is a um, really uh, interesting way to, uh, I think, leverage both the QR code call to action uh, for kind of like a frictionless. Um, uh, experience on the consumer side uh, and uh, marrying that with the experience you want on the on the messaging side whether that's uh, through um, SMS Google chat Facebook Messenger what have you so anyway uh, just a quick uh, demo of what we've learned and are continuing to learn and uh, feel free to, to reach out if uh, you want to talk about this or explore how to set it up uh, for your business all right take care